there's a lot of criticism of that today where the cup guys come in and dominate these, these Xfinity now is what the series is called. And it drives people crazy because they don't feel like they're given the opportunity for these young kids to shine and gain points and, and gain notoriety. And I beg to differ because had I not been in that series racing against the best, learning from them, but also if I didn't hadn't won that race in Atlanta that day and beat Mark Martin and Dale Earnhardt and Dale Jarrett and Mark, uh, um, you know, other cup drivers, nobody would have even noticed me in my opinion. And, and Rick Hendrick noticed me that day. And that's, you know, what got me to the cup level. And is that his first real look at you? Yeah, well, the way he tells the story is the first thing that he saw was some kid driving the car sideways with smoke rolling off the right rear tire. And he, he told, I think it was some people that either worked for him or a friend, he was walking down along the track while the race is, is, is going on. And they were headed somewhere else. And he said, hold on, hold on. This kid's going to wreck. Let's stay here and watch. Um, <laughs> and they kept watching. They kept watching. I kept sliding it through the corner, sliding it through the corner, and I never wrecked. And, and what he found, so after that race, he immediately said, how do we get in touch with, with Jeff Gordon? Jeff Gordon.